Hey pretties, welcome back to my channel. It is currently 4.01. I'm about to get dressed. Um, I already like took a shower and washed my face and everything. The camera is crooked. Why? It'd it be the crooked camera for me. It was just fine too. Like, don't be acting up because you recorded now. What the hell? Anyways, you guys, I wanted to show you guys three days of my life. So it's gonna be like I'm gonna call it the week of my life, but it's really not. But I'm honestly gonna probably tie this video like me getting a puppy because that's the whole point of this video. And I just I'm so excited, y'all. I have not slept this whole week. Like I've been sleeping dub, but like literally, you guys, today's the last day of school, by the way. Today's Wednesday, November 25th. Um, I'm supposed to be getting my puppy on the 27th. So if I do, I'm going to cry. And that day is Black Friday. So like I'm like that line for this puppy store that I want to go to is already gonna be long. I already know because they're already long. Y'all go y'all listen, y'all. I already have my plan, like everything. I'm telling my mom, like, I'm gonna by four o'clock, getting ready by four thirty, so I can take my Uber at four thirty or four thirty five and get there at five o'clock and stand in that line. Today I'm getting my hair done. Yeah, I take my hair so serious like it's not even funny like i don't even care about my nails my hair has to be done and i was supposed to get my hair done today but like i don't know what happened thankfully they they freaking came through so i'm excited i'm planning on wearing a brown like nude set and i got it on sale girl because i didn't even know that they was having black friday sales all week so i've been like shopping non-stop okay you guys i'm gonna be vlogging this whole week what well, the end of this whole week oh uh, my hair appointment is at four five o'clock it is 406 so i'm about to get ready real quick i'm gonna see you guys when i'm back and get my hair done two hours later Hey guys, I'm back from getting my hair done. I know I look so different. Like this is different. I know it's cute. It's giving me very much Chang Li. Um, she also gave me her merch. Like, why are you dumb? Are you stupid? I'm loving the nudes. Like, but anyways, guys. Um, she really bodied my hair. Like, it's exactly what I wanted. I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow, probably in the afternoon. Cause my dad's gonna come mad late to get me. I already know how he is. So. Yes, girl. Yes. Yeah, this shit's gonna be all about my family. So I'm so excited. So I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. Um, yeah. And then it's so close to Friday because I'm getting my puppy. But my mom playing music, so I'm out of here, y'all. The following day. All right, you guys. My room has been getting me tight because like there's so much stuff going on. It's bothering me. Um, I'm about to change. They're big. Ooh, this would be a look. They're really cute. But I'm like, I feel like this would this would be cute. So I might just say this because this top is cute and tight, and this is like big baggy jeans. But I want to wear this brown outfit so bad. So I feel like just. Wear this and my telfer bag. Hey guys, I'm back. I'm about to do my quick makeup routine. It only takes me about five minutes to do this because it's really easy. Um, I'm gonna show you guys what I do real quick. I got to my vitamins, so I'm about to just eat this granola bar real quick. Stop something in my system. I don't know. I put too much like I'm really doing my whole makeup. Alright y'all, I'm gonna come back after I wash my hands and put my whole outfit together. I'm sure you guys will finish your look and then I'll be on to my family house. My dad is still not here yet, so I'm just waiting for him because I'm ready now. I'm just gonna clean my room up just a little bit and I'm gonna be out. Yes, yes, yes. And I'm gonna see you guys probably when I'm eating because I'm gonna eat real well. And my dad is here. Look at my dad. Daddy, you do this in every video. Please talk for once. <laughs> hey guys, so I'm back from my Thanksgiving dinner. Don't mind my nose. Mind your business. You're my business. Don't do that. Guys, I did not get to vlog because I was too busy enjoying time with my family. Um, yeah, everything was great. And I usually stay over, but since today is a big day for me, I couldn't. It is currently 1251 and I'm going to get my puppy today. I don't know if I told you guys the puppy part. I feel like I did, but I didn't. Long story short, I'm getting a puppy today because your girl has been suffering with like not anxiety, but like I've been suffering with like having no company. Like, what is that called? <laughs> I don't want people all the time, you know. I love animals. Like, I could, I could be with an animal all day. I could be with babies all day. Those are still like people, but like you know, I could be with somebody that I want to take care of all day. You know, like that wants to cuddle with me all day. Like you know, that wants to be babied. I want to do that. You know, but no, you guys, it is about to be one o'clock. I'm gonna take my shower at probably like one thirty, um, and lay down for like until like three thirty. Get ready at four and be out the house by five. Cause I'm not putting on makeup or nothing, so I'm not gonna take long. Probably be out before five, so I can get there at five. You know. But I also went to the bank, you guys, like 20 minutes ago. I literally just got back. So yeah, my dad had left and then he was like, did you go to the bank? And I was like, no. And then he was like, she so gonna go with your mom? I said, can you just take me? He was like, whatever, fine. Like he didn't want to, but like he a good dad, so he just did anyways. We're gonna bring chairs tomorrow. As you can hear, she said he's gonna bring chairs tomorrow, which is totally fine with me. Anyways, so yeah guys, I'm really excited. I'm just like, mm -mm -mm, like I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. I got her some toys. The only thing I got her right now, I don't know if I'm gonna get a boy or a girl. I really want a girl. So yeah, but I don't wanna be too picky if they don't have any more girls i'm just saying i want a boy because i ain't waiting no longer for no damn puppy hopefully it's a girl like i'm praying it's a girl i've been praying this whole 
two weeks y'all for this like don't even play with me but i've been playing for puppy for even longer so um first i got her these two little donuts it also came with like a little big not a little but a big puppuccino toy that i gave to my puppy snoopy because he's a lot bigger like he's a bigger dog like he's like this big he's probably like 50 pounds and though that i'm gonna get probably gonna be like five pounds a weight difference is like you know crazy so i gave the big toy to him and i'm gonna give the little toys to his sister um it's a chocolate donut and a strawberry donut that's my favorite type of donuts well actually my favorite is um jelly donuts but you know these are still good this was eight dollars really expensive but my dad bought it so <laughs> and it hurt my pockets and i also got her this two days ago when i was out with my friend it's only four dollars like a little furry friend for her to be comfortable in and it's squeeze. I didn't even know this. Just for her to feel good, like, if I have to take a shower, if I'm, like, leaving the house just for a second and I can't bring her because, like, she's probably not going to have all her shots yet. I'm really excited. And I also didn't order none of the stuff online yet because I didn't know if I was going to get a boy or a girl. I want a girl, but I never had a girl before. I always had male puppies. I already have a male puppy, you guys. You guys just heard about him. His name is Snoopy. He's a, um English Cocker Spaniel. He's black. He's so cute. And he was, like, the only black puppy in his whole, like, family. So my dad was like, yeah, it's going to be for her. And you're probably wondering, like, Ice and Wally's not with you. I'm rich to my puppy Snoopy, and I'm really sad because, like, of course, that's my baby. Like, he knows I'm his mom. Like, But I can't take him because I literally die when I went for him, and I hate that because it makes me cry. Like, literally, I was crying when we was going home today because I was trying to pet him today, right? And I did pet him. I did wash my hands after. But he was whining because he wanted some food because, you know, Thanksgiving dinner. So I told him to stop, and he only listened to me when I say stop and to sit and stuff like that. I know that's so ironic and weird. He's a brat. So he knows that I'd be serious when I say stop, so he stopped. But, like... I just started sneezing after. I'm like, what? I wasn't even that close to him. Like, I, he was in his cage, and I was, like, right here. It was, like, crazy. So, I can't be around him, and I'm so sad about that. So, I technically gave it to my grandma, but not technically, because they still say it's my dog. So, they don't really know that I gave it to them, because I didn't even, we didn't agree on that, but, you know, whatever. But, you yeah, guys, so that's the plan. So, I have all the stuff. I'm going to get her online from Amazon, but I am going to go to Petco, obviously, to buy her a bowl. Some PP pads. I need those pads, obviously. Some treats. Um... A bed, just for now. I'm going to get her cage online because I, I want her to have a pink cage. Everything I want her to have is going to be pink. And I also have to clean up my room, but I'm going to clean it out after she comes. Um, I just have, like, a lot of boxes. Not even dirty. It's just, like, boxes that I want her area to be where the boxes are. Because she's going to be staying in my room, by the way, because it's going to be my puppy, not my mom. It's going to be actually just mine. I'm paying with my own money. I took the money out literally 20 minutes ago, so I'm prepared. And my price limit, I don't know if I tell you guys, I think I told you guys my price limit, but I'm not trying to spend no more than 2000 but I'm really only, my limit is 1500 and I'm not trying to spend, and I don't want to kind of spend over 1200 My target is 1200 I can do 1500 but I don't want to do over 2000 And the breeds that I'm interested in are, particularly, like, honestly, I just, they, I, they all cute to me. A toy poodle, a toy yorkie, a Maltese, and a, sh not a shisu, a multi -poo. So, yeah. So those are the four breeds I'm interested in, so I'm really excited. I, I was thinking about a Shih Tzu at first, but now I was like, no, I don't really want one. So I'm going to see you guys later on today. I'm going to take my shower at, at 1.30. It is currently 1.03. Um, I'm going to stay laying down until like 2.30. No, 3 o'clock. Get ready. No, 3.30. Get ready at 4. Be at the house by 4.30 so I can get there at 5. So I'm going to see you guys later on. <sighs> and let's pray I get this puppy. Hey guys, so it's two hours later. I did not go to sleep at all like I told you guys I wanted. It is literally 4.14. I'm ready to go. We're leaving at 4.30 so we're so close. Literally like 16 minutes left. I'm going to see you guys when I get there. I'm so excited to meet see the puppies. I'm on my phone. But it's almost 4.30. But my mom is sleeping so I guess I'm going to just leave at 5 and get there at um 5.30 because... I don't want to wake her up because she's tired, I guess. Whatever. But if she's not ready by five, I'm just going to leave for y'all. I ain't going to lie to y'all because, yeah. Four hours later. Now it's 9.20. And me and my mom is still here. So you guys, two hours after that previous clip, I finally made inside the pet shop. I was so excited, y'all. I love puppies. Like, who really doesn't? When you hear those puppies barking, it's like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, my heart was melting. And as y'all can see, I fell in love with those two puppies that's in my hand. I really wanted both, y'all, but like, let's be real here. My bank would have literally been smacking me in my face, so we couldn't do that. So then it came to the hardest part, you guys. I really dread this part every time I look at this video because I could not decide for real. But I'm glad I made the right choice because it's something that I knew I needed to do. The white one is a lot smaller than the brown one, so you know, obviously she's a lot more responsibility. She's double the price, and also I have to like check 
up on her more and i don't want to spend so much more money on a dog for me to not have as much experience you know and i feel like that's not fair for her because she needs to go to somebody that knows about puppies more and obviously can handle her and handle the responsibility and obviously yes i know when you get a puppy you ask for the responsibility but the breeder did tell me you know like can you really handle it like you know you got to be with her 24 7 and obviously you guys i want my puppy 24 7 but she was telling me like you know she needs this she needs that and i'm like I don't even know what a regular puppy needs. You know, I know what they need, but, you know, it's like when you're a first-time owner of anything, it's like you want to start slow and then work your way up because you'll have experience. I don't want to mess up, you know. I feel like she belongs to a family that just knows, like, you know, oh, yeah, she needs it, she needs that, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. You know, so I'm definitely going to get a puppy just like her in the future. So, you know, my puppy can obviously have a playmate, but for now... Let me get my experience. And my puppy is in a good home. You know, I'm taking great care of her. And I feel like she's a perfect match for me because she's a lot of responsibility too. But I could just imagine, you guys, how much the white one would have been, especially with no experience. So, yeah, and after this clip, I'm going to show you guys me signing the papers. And, yeah, I finally bring her home. And you guys get to meet her. And I'm so excited. All right, guys, so this is all the stuff. So I have to go shopping. I'm going to get the cute stuff later on. Icy signing off for her new baby. Diamond. She making boss moves. That's, oh. a, that's a boss move. Period. I've never spent this much a day in my life. You signed it. It's in there somewhere. Can't see. Oh, there she is. Guys, look at her. Hold on. Let me open her. I know she wants to get out. All right, you guys, so y'all saw a little clip of her because my freaking phone died when I was trying to show you guys. I had to bring my camera like I told you guys. But this is Diamond. I named her Diamond. I was going to name her Chanel, but then I changed my mind. She just, she's like so cute and she's so shy. Look at Diamond. I'm literally going to cry. You are so cute. So cute. She's so cute and she's so small. She didn't cry this, the whole ride, you guys. She cried for like five seconds. She was like, mm. But that was it. But yeah, right. And she keeps on crossing her legs. That is so cute. It's only 12.33, you guys. So I'm going to go out later on and get her like a little, a wee-wee pie little thing. She's shaking. She looks like she's so unbothered. Like, and I like that. She's not crazy like the other ones. She's eight weeks old. She was born on September 26th, I think. I think. I I, I have the papers. I literally just got her, so don't, don't come for me. She is a teddy bear. She's a shit poodle mixed with a, a poodle, I think. And she's literally what I wanted, you guys. Like, look how cute she is. She's so cute! Amen! Look at her lay on me, y'all. <laughs> Okay, so I was debating between her and the white one. You guys saw the white one is, like, way smaller. I think she's going to be diamond size when she gets older, but diamond's going to be, like, 10 pounds, maybe. Like, 8 to 10 pounds. I hope she's only going to be 8 because, like, I want a small puppy. You know, I couldn't pass her up because she was the only brown teddy bear. Now we got you. She has a little white, though, right here. A little patch. I think she's tired, y'all. She's really tired. She likes this. She's falling asleep. Oh, she woke up again. She's, like, the break. Let me show you guys where I got her. I'm gonna let her lay down. I know she's tired. Come, 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 come. Come, 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 come. Come, 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 come. <laughs> she's scared, y'all. You heard her crying. Okay, you guys. I'm gonna show you guys like what I got for her. What she came with. She wants to be in her box right now. Cause I guess it, like it smells like ugh, where she was. Let me show you guys what I got for her little puppy haul real quick. And also. Oh my god, now she wants to get out. Oh, come on. I think she has to pee, that's why she's crying. So. I know. Okay. She got 100 training pads. She came with this big bag. Um. What are you doing, Diamond? <laughs> So she came with this little booklet. This is a read me and it's all about her and everything, you know. Next thing, she came with a bag of food. This is Holistic Health Extension Little Bites for teacups, toys, and miniature dogs. She came with this. It's only for emergencies, though. Next thing, she came with more food. This is cans of food. This is the um, soft, the wet food, basically. I have to start this tomorrow. This is just antibiotics for her stomach because she's still a baby. I don't know what this is. I think this is if you don't, like... Oh, okay, this is to steal the um, can, okay. Also got this. This is just some vitamins for her. I have to use this um, until she's old enough, I guess. 
This is more wet food. He also said, well, the girl also said that I have to mix her water with the Gatorade. So I have that. And I also have more Gatorade. And I love Gatorade. So, like, this is perfect. They also said to give her Frosted Flakes, you could eat these too. So I bought this, like, um, bundle because I told you guys I didn't buy nothing because I didn't know what gender I was getting. This whole pack, it was, like, a Black Friday deal. It was, like, 130-something or 143. I forgot. But I got 100 training pass. I have to buy any for a while. I got her this ugly bed just for now because she needs something to sleep on until I get her real bed. Also has this um, little feeder, I guess, to put in the cage. This was at the um, pet shop, so this is pretty cute. This is just a, um, a little bowl to put inside the cage, the crate too, but I don't think I'm going to do that, honestly. It's only 1.16, guys, so I got back earlier than I expected, so I'm going to go to Petco later on, probably by like 3 o'clock. And I know it's Black Friday, but I got to go because I want to get her some bowls. I don't have no bowls for her. Um, I just want to take her home first. I don't want to have her outside because she could get sick, and I don't want that to happen. And I also got her some more toys. I got her a Chewy toy. Um, this is a little like tug of war thing. It's lime green. This is pink. And the last one is just this. What is this actually? Oh yeah, she also has her collar. This right here. I'm gonna put this on her. I'm gonna see you guys when I go to Petco to buy her her little bowls. And probably what else I see that she probably gonna want. Unless she knows who she wants. I'm gonna show my dad guys. Daddy, look. The cat diamond. I thought you wanted a toy, the one that's little like your hand. And she was the only brown one. <laughs> How much? Oh, Done. I still want to buy her a cushion, but I'm gonna order everything online. So I put the TV in the background. I'm watching something. I'm gonna set up her little thing real quick. This is what she had when she was at the pet store. You probably like, so why did you adopt and not? I mean, why did you buy and not adopt? Well, <clears throat> if there were any more puppies to adopt, I would have did that. <laughs> so you just gotta figure out how to do this yourself. Okay, it's not rocket science. It's pretty easy. Three hours later. See guys, this is my little quick hack. And I got my daughter right there. She loves being under me. I think that's so cute, y'all. Like, we literally are just falling in love. I'm gonna wear the same coat I wore earlier because it's kind of chilly, I think, probably. I'll see you guys at her coat. Look, y'all, she's about to start crying. <laughs> Secure the bag at Petco. I almost spent a hundred dollars on nothing. You guys, I came back and she was a good girl. Oh, yeah, guys, and I noticed when I put this cover on top. It really helps soothe her. Alright guys, so I'm back from Petco. We're well, going shopping. So first thing I went to was Petco. And I'm never going to Petco ever again because they're so expensive. I thought it was going to spend like $30, like literally. I got the bird dish thing, which is basically what they gave me for my puppy the, to put her food in. So I got her another cup. also got this Nature's Miracle Stain and Odor Remover. This was $12.99. And tell me why, when I literally just went to Burlington, I saw this, not the same brand, but it was still this same size and everything, for $5. Also got the hypoallergenic deodorizing wipes, and these are just like to refreshing her and stuff. Also got her training treats. So when I started training her, which I'm gonna start very early because Mm -mm. I got peanut butter because like a little dessert and I also got her savory chicken treats and this is by Baby Boo and Baby Boo I heard is a really good brand because when I was researching and watching all these dog videos because I was like freaking puppy what do they call that mom when you puppy fever right mm -hmm. yeah I had puppy fever I got these two because they, they I don't know they was only a dollar and I just wanted to see if she liked them this is just like to put in the dry food because I know the dry food sometimes is just bland broad boost mixers and it's grain free it's protein packed and it's all natural and then some cute stuff first i got her a stocking it says first christmas and then the last thing from pet code engraved pet id tag um they do have some on amazon for cheaper but they don't have a small version because she's really small i don't want to get her a big one it's hanging off of her like it's a freaking chain then i went to tj maxx and i got her some christmas toys and then i went to five below this little cushion 
for her crates i also got this little thing to put under my couch for her stuff because i don't want her stuff everywhere all the time so cute little pink organizing thing and this is only 425 okay and on to the clothes you know just some fun stuff so first of all i got us matching socks mom look at this are you serious i got the snowflake ones because y'all yeah, gonna see why it's only four dollars but i got the socks because i got this cute sweater look at the sweater so cute it's gonna be her christmas outfit by the way so y'all get a little sneak peek the last thing i got her was this little cute pet jacket guys that's literally everything i got and i'm gonna see you guys tomorrow to update you guys on how she's doing i'm gonna see you guys later the next day hey guys i'm back with diamond it's 10 16 like i said today i put an hour back on all her stuff so it would make sense sense and now I'm gonna give her her antibiotics. 0.2, she said. So this is gonna be her first day of taking it. And now I'm giving you guys a quick little update on my little princess. First off, she does not want to ever sleep. Also, I'm crate training her because I already know if I ever start school again, I have to be prepared. I don't want her to be in the house crying like, where did she go? Blah blah blah. Um, another thing. What else? She does take her vitamins. She's a really good puppy. She's so nice. Yet, yeah, okay. See, she's looking at you guys. This is a perfect example. Yesterday, she was not doing that. I feel like she's getting comfortable, and she's also biting me. She's teething. Um, so, yeah. But yeah, um, she's doing good with the crate training. When I put her in, she doesn't cry. Like, she probably will cry a little bit, but she's not, like, crying how she was yesterday. Oh, my gosh. Um, her personality. She thinks she's a, like, she's so slick, y'all. When I, every time I leave her in the room, like, I let her frolic around. When I come back in, she just poses. Like, she does something wrong, just smiles at me, like, like, you know, like, she be winking well. She she winks. Like, she blinks, I guess, but with one eye. <laughs> I think it's so funny. And like this video if you guys want me to vlog her first. Doctor appointment. <gasps> Get a cute little look at Simon. Bye, buddies. Remember when I told you guys I would, like, do a first day vet visit? <laughs> well, today's the day. I told you guys that she was doing fine and stuff, but now she's not eating. It's been two days now that she haven't been eating. I have to force her to eat. So, which is recommended by the, um, pet breed that I got her from so I'm taking her to the vet right now her appointment's at 4 15 all right y'all my camera died but like I got her ready we're about to leave the girl go hey guys mm -hmm. so we're back from the vet as you guys can see it's 5 25 so her appointment was at um 4 15 like I told you guys so that was a quick appointment wasn't it I was expecting to leave at this time but you know whatever y'all tell me why right we get there right i have to fill out paperwork because you know i'm new whatever so i'm sitting down on the bench they have like three different benches so i sat down on the first bench so you know the girl could see me just in case i want to ask her a question about what is accent tell me why i'm sitting down on the bench a cat just comes out of literally nowhere and y'all know me i do not like cats and i know you're probably like ice and you have a freaking cat I don't even like her. So don't even tell me about no cat. So a doctor came in. He says, you know, what you're here for? I said the vaccinations and also she's not eating. I want to find out what's wrong. He said, okay, cool. And he's like, how long have you had the puppy? It's new. Like, where's it from? I told him where it's from. I said, yes, I had it only for three days. And he was like, oh, okay, so let's wait a little bit longer before you get the vaccination. So we got to the eating part. He was like, she's not eating nothing. I said, no. He was like, she's not drinking. She's not eating. Really? I just told you to her. Like, yes, why would I lie? So he checked her out. He said that her temperature is fine no fever um she has the perfect weight her lungs and everything is clear she's active so she's fine yeah and nothing wrong with her i don't know why she's not eating so he gave me a thing to like test her poop oh she's falling asleep y'all <laughs> i'm weak but anyways i'm about to give her food and her vitamins because she can take her vitamins and stuff it's perfectly healthy I'm, I'm really happy about that at least i know that she's healthy you know other than that i still want her to eat of course like duh so i'm gonna try to give her something um and see what happens i'll be back y'all let me i'm much at all she eat honestly Hey pretties, um, I just came back from going shopping, so I figured I'll show you guys a puppy haul. So, I went to Five Below two different times. Um, yesterday and today. You guys could obviously tell I love Five Below for my puppy. I got this, I like big bags, and I cannot lie for her because I feel like that little jaw that I got her, I should just put like her bows and like, you know, her little accessories and like socks and stuff. But I should put her clothes in here, so I got this because she gonna like a big bag because she gonna be in a big bag when I carry her around. So, next thing I got her was this cute little cuddly thing like when she's sleeping, you know, she got something like lay on she loves to lay on her rabbit this right here i knew she was gonna love this because it makes a squeaking sound next thing i got her was this leash um i don't really care for this leash only reason why i got this leash just in case like you know for clothes of course i had to get her another cute little christmas sweater this one's really cute and i also got her these one dollar toys yes they have one dollar toys and they're christmas themed so you know i had to get them so just to scrub her stuff you know if i don't want to touch it i also got some ziploc bags so, like when i'm carrying her food in a bag so i got her these cute little 
pet sweaters or hoodies. I always want her to have a hoodie. She doesn't have no, well, she does have a hoodie actually, but you know, these are really cute. Three days later. Hey guys, so yes, I know I said bye, man time, but I'm back. I promise the only last time for this video because I want to give you guys the reality of how it is to have a puppy. And also, this is my first puppy by myself, you guys. Like I said, I have puppies before in the past, but she's my full responsibility. I pay for her with my own money. I have to buy everything with my own money. Like, the cost of the vet and everything, my own money, out my own pocket. So, And I also order stuff on Amazon, y'all. So, if you guys want to see a separate puppy haul, let me know. I'll definitely do one for you guys. Tell me your face, mamas. Aww. Yes, final haul. I went to Burlington Dollar Tree, um, Petco, what else? Oh yeah, and shot right to get her some stuff. Today will be our last can of food if I did not get her any food today. So I decided like I need to get her some food, of course, and also I might as well get her some other stuff that she needs because you know, where I go first. First I went to Dollar Tree. Let's start with Dollar Tree. That's the first store I went to. I really wanted a cupcake um holder. So I got this because I don't have a cupcake pan holder, whatever this is called, and it's metal. So, and my mom wanted this little mesh strainer, so I got this is strainer, yeah. So I got this as well. I don't. She's a cook, so she, you know, she be shopping it up. Though my mom is really the best cook out there. But I ended up getting my other pet some stuff too. Let's be real here. Ginger is not my cat. If you don't know who Ginger is, by the way, Ginger is my mom's cat. Um. Yeah, we had her since she was a kitten. She was so cute. I think we got her when she was nine weeks old. I forgot, but she was really, really small. We adopted her from the shelter, so yeah. Of course, I had to spoil her because why not? Last thing I got her was this cat collar because she doesn't have one. On to the start of the show, Diamond. I got her also a cat collar because she's so small. Also go to Dollar Tree for a, get one for a dollar. Next thing I got her is this toy, and I got this toy because it looked like my socks. And I'm tired of her messing with my socks and not playing with her actual toys. Pink, of course. Now on to the food and the treat. I wanted her to try different puppy chow because the puppy chow that they gave her, she don't like it. And I also got some more treats because the treats that I got her from Petco were $6.99 each or $7.99 each. And she don't even like them. Moving on to Burlington. So I got her the Arm & Hammer Heavy Duty Baby Wipes for Pets. Removes odor and freshen skin. And it's safe for dogs 8 weeks of age or older. And I also got her these wee wee pads y'all because she's been going through wee wee pads like there's no tomorrow so we got two pads just in case so if you're looking for some wee wee pads for a good price check out burlington it's only 15 dollars for 100 yes y'all you heard me 100 freaking pads for 15 dollars and a pet kobe sell them for like 30 dollars for 20 30 dollars for 30 and you can get 200 for 30 dollars are you serious i got her the pink ones of course so we have one pink pack of 100 left. Moving on to Petco. So I told you guys she's went out of food. So I know she likes the Caesar food because I've been feeding her the Caesar food because the breeder had gave me a bunch of different wet foods for her to eat. And they also gave me a Caesar puppy. I did not see no Caesar puppy, but I saw a Caesar. Next thing I got her that's food related are these um raw boost mixers. These are her favorite when she see me take this packet out she goes insane she loves these you guys move it down to only dinner time you know so she'll just be like happy for dinner then by instinct the raw brand i got her the chicken flavor because she loves chicken flavor you guys saw me mention this earlier she loves this so i got it again because i know she's gonna eat it um i got her the small version though so now she has the big version this one is resealable last thing i got are these silicone candles just to like you know store her food and i really wanted to have all pink but it's okay it fits multiple can sizes so this is perfect last place i went to was Shoprite. at Shoprite, they did have this bella brand that's also the same brand as this puppy chow. I got both of these because I want her to try it. I don't know if she's gonna like it or not. I just want her to have different brands just in case, you know, I can't find that brand at the store. I know she likes this one as well. And then I got her this Beneful, also by the same brand. Incredible Bites, just for small dogs. 12 pack. Like, if I was a dog, I would want this. But yeah, you guys, this is literally everything I got. I'm just happy I have her. Happy she's healthy and she's doing great. Look, she likes her vitamins, you guys. It's so cute. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Basically spending uh, my whole paycheck on Simon. And I'm going to see you guys in my next video. Well, we're going to see you guys in the next video. We love you guys so much. Bye, pretties. Say bye, pretties. Bye, pretties. Keep it real, I ain't worried about